My role on developing Cicero was on the language side. One thing that impressed me about Cicero's dialogue capabilities is that it's able to hold conversations with people for a long time in a very fluent way, six different conversations simultaneously, which is actually very different to other dialogue settings people have explored before. It's human-like, it's strategic, it's frustrating sometimes, it's persuasive. The major challenge we solved in Cicero is being able to make language models interface with symbolic reasoning. Previously, AI was essentially just trying to parrot what humans say on the internet. Cicero is notable because when it says things, they're grounded in the world. So they refer to concrete events and actions in the world. It's trying to say something better than humans would say, and better than you can achieve by just copying. We're really able to build something that's quite compelling and can actually hold conversations and do its own reasoning and planning and accomplish this in a really impressive way.